Once you finish Cinderbrick Fort, Kids you're going to want to build on Amazon the bottom right foundation. So place the core in, head to the bottom right, and it doesn't matter what you build at this point, so just build whatever comes up and head to the next level, which is Pith Orchard. So to start Pith Orchard, in order to get up, you want to be holding down your left mouse button so you can move right away, and just pressing your roll key repeatedly to actually get up. Folks used to make so just go along a little bit and then right here I'm going to do one more roll forward and then I'm going to do a musket shot and with this musket shot you want to clear a hole in the fence so that you can get through and also shoot the wood pile that you can see at the top of the screen so this is what it looks like do that and then you can see there's a nice path to get through to the rest of the level. So now it's a pretty uh, straightforward path to follow to get to the pith fight. Right here, uh, once the ground finishes forming up and I'm able to roll, I'm going to roll. And then you'll see the boss uh, appear on screen. He's in the top left area now. So I'm going to roll forward, lob a grenade at him. So don't lock onto him yet, but lob it in the air. Then roll forward, throw a targeted grenade at him, and finish him off with a hammer and musket shot. So here's what that looks like. Grenade, grenade, hammer, musket. And then once you kill him, enter the shrine, exit immediately, and just make your way back to the start of the level. Uh, one other thing to note right here, you need to get somewhat close to these stab weeds to clear them with a musket shot because again the musket damage depends on how close you are. So get somewhat close, maybe a little bit closer than I am now. Uh, go for the musket shot and then roll around the corner and just head to the skyway. That's all there is to Pith Orchard. Uh, it's a pretty short level.